Okay, so there is quite a bit to talk about here. Um, the offense was honestly pretty good. All right, the offense was honestly pretty darn good, except for when we gave up the safety. Oh my god! Or at least I think there was a safety. I wasn't able to watch the game, but it went from a five-point game to a seven-point game. So there's got to be a safety somewhere. Oh. Um. I wasn't missing nothing. I wasn't able to watch the game as I work. I just saw one from five point game to seven point game. Something happened. Okay, we had the ball, and then it was Houston zero. Yeah, I believe there was. I believe there was a safety. I don't know. I could be wrong. You know what I'm saying? But. Our offense was good, right? We gave up only three sacks. Our offensive line is good. We need to build back up the defense, okay? Build back up the defense. Defense wins championships. Defense wins games. Doesn't matter how good our offense is, we need to have a good defense as well if we're going to get anywhere. This team, we got a good offense. We can protect the Sean Watson now. Uh, don't just give up. Maybe add a couple more pieces in the offseason, but don't waste any more draft picks on O line. Get defensive linemen now. Get defensive players now. Okay? We got the offensive pieces. We got the offensive pieces. Now we need the defensive pieces. And watching some of the replays. Because, yes, I am a Texans fan. So I'm gonna watch some of the replays, and I'm gonna keep. I was keeping an eye on the game as well, but I'm gonna watch some replays. There's one one touchdown we should have had. Just watching gets the ball, he breaks it on one tackle. Duke gets on his foot, throws the ball almost immediately, gets hit. Fucking catches the ball, touchdown. Wait, no, it was apparently a sack. Because he had pressure. I don't care what the rules say. That was bullshit. Okay? I don't care what the rules say or whatever. I don't care if it falls in line with the rules or whatever. That was bullshit. And I'll say it for... If I saw that play for any team and I was just out there, I would have gone, what the hell? What the fuck? That is just a bullshit call. Okay? If it was a call, if I was playing and I was against the other team, I would have been like, thank God. But I'm not going to sit back and act like it wasn't a bullshit call because that was bullshit. Okay, whatever it is, change the rule, whatever. I'm saying Bob, but change the rule or whatever it is. Rewrite the wording. I understand. Sean Watson wasn't wrapped up. The play wasn't motionless. The play wasn't stopped. Watson. Oh, man. It was... He, he didn't stop momentum. He threw the... This was... It was... That was just wrong, man. That was just wrong. Okay. But we lost. I'm not even that angry. I'm just highly disappointed. Because... Uh, I want this team to do great. But I'm... This team has problems, has its issues, and well, yeah, we're not gonna win division this year. This loss with the rest of the Colts schedule and the West rest of our schedule, I project Colts winning division and us getting a wild card spot. Yes, I, I still think we're gonna make the playoffs. We're just gonna be in a wild card spot. Yay. And I think the Colts now hold the second seed, which sucks. Um, I don't know if they're going to end up with the second seed. Uh, they might. It might go to the Chiefs. We're probably going, I don't know, we're probably going to end up facing whoever wins the AFC North. 
because we may get the better the first wild card spot and I think we could be we could win that one and go to the division divisional round but uh, I don't know but if we face a team like the Chiefs or the Colts which would be the other two team, which would probably be the only other two teams we we would face. We wouldn't be facing the Patriots in the wild card. We face the Colts or the Chiefs, we'd have trouble. Seriously, best best hope. I don't know. This is this is not this is not our year. Okay, I'm just gonna say that this is not a year. We got to start looking to the next year. We got to start working on the pieces. And I'm just going to say, I, this isn't a controversial thing at all. I really don't think Bill O'Brien's the best coach for the Texans. But the thing is, I'm not sure who we get next as a coach is going to be better. I don't know if we're going to get a better coach if we end up firing O'Brien and getting a different coach. I don't know. We may end up getting a worse coach. We could get a better coach. We could end up with a worse coach. I honestly don't know. So I don't know what to do. I don't know who we would hire. Uh, I don't know. I just, I don't know about this team at all. The Texans. One day we will get a Super Bowl. I don't know when. Don't know how. One day we will. It's not going to be this year. The Texans just aren't good enough yet. But that doesn't mean we give up. Texans are so close. We are close. We are a good team. And we are so close. We get we get the right pieces we uh in the offseason. Or we get the right pieces now for signing some free agents. Uh, make a, the right trades. I don't know. Uh but if we get the right pieces soon, we could be Super Bowl bound. We got a franchise wide receiver we still have jj watt we need to have other defensive plays around them we got merciless we still we got uh let's we got hopkins we got stills we got fuller we got johnson and hyde right now right now a good one-two punch running back duo we got a good team we we need to find the right, just a few more of the right pieces, and then we can be Super Bowl bound. It's not that we're a bad team. It's just we're not the most complete team out there. There's more teams that are just more complete out there. Look at the Colts, okay? They lost luck, but without luck, they're showing they didn't need luck. They got a good a quarterback that's pretty good. He may not, I don't know if he's elite yet, but he's a good quarterback. And he's got a definitely got a good team around him, considering that they are four two right now. It's the Colts are a pretty decent team. Yet I we need we need to fill in the holes. That's what we need to focus on. We need to focus on figuring out what the holes are and trying to fill them in because right now we're not a complete team we don't have everything we need for a super bowl run at least not in my opinion we get the right pieces then we can talk about a super bowl run until then we're just gonna be the team that nobody gets respect to even when we are good